All right, let's see what we got here. A goddess team with Mael. Okay, okay. Um, he's using Rid. Yeah, using Rid, uh, Liz. That's gonna be pretty interesting. I guess I'll just buff up then. And I guess we can set up this. Cause you gotta remember that with my team, pretty much we're gonna do crazy damage to him. He could also push for my ultimate as well, but he has to attack. Cause the whole thing is that every time he attacks, he's gonna proc my passive. And then we're gonna have our ultimate instantly. So the more he attacks us, the more he's gonna proc my Liz and Margo passive. Only bad thing is that I am stat lord. But I should be able to tank right here. Because I'll go for I went for the buff. Yep. And I think I heal up right here as well, right here. Yep. And now we can just go crazy. Uh, with my team especially Liz so we're gonna go for this and then this gold card so this should be GG all right see you my boy wow I love this Liz so much in chaos pp I this is like usually my favorite team in chaos pp just because it's so broken bro because people forget about the the whole Liz instant max passive uh with this team they forget all about this team it's so much fun all right what we got here transcendent bond okay this might get a little bit annoying i ain't gonna lie transcendent bond is a really annoying character to play against so he's definitely gonna remove my stance instantly Let's go for this. I think the the only thing that will probably help me in this match is probably getting multiple stance removal. Not stance removal. Stances. And then try to push for like Margaret's ultimate or something. Yeah, because you see with him, he's just going to push for his ultimate on us. Yeah, you see he's like really stalling this out. Cause he wants to try to push for a bone ultimate and he has green arthur so it's also even more annoying because he has green arthur and i don't know if it's gonna save me i think he's gonna take away my old gauge right here but my team isn't an offensive team so it's not like i can go after arthur so he's gonna stance remove me and then take away my old gauge right here Wait, what? Wait, why didn't you just take my old gauge? I'm so confused. I mean, he does have his ultimate on her, but he's going to get disabled. But now you can't take away anything. Uh, I'm so confused right now. Right, I guess I'll go for this then. Okay, it's just fine because he's gonna get disabled on everybody else. And I guess I can probably set up my uh, Liz then and start attacking his Arthur. I guess I can go for that. Because he's disabled right now for two turns. And he keep proccing my passive as well, which is really good for us. It's not gonna kill. Is it disabled? I think the whole person I gotta really get rid of is definitely um Bond. I don't know if I'm doing enough damage though. Am I max passive right now? Oh yeah, I'm stacked. I'm stacked right now. I think I can get rid of Bond right here. All right. Hopefully this hap hopefully this works out. I should do enough damage. We got two silver cards. 
Okay, and it should be GG right here. Oh my god, I didn't crit. No, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my god. If he doesn't stat lower me, I'm I'm not stat lower. Uh take my old gauge. I think I'm good. Bro, that's so upsetting. He's about to prevent me from AoEing, isn't he? Yep. Yep, I can't AoE now. And then he takes one old gauge. And what's Bond about to do? Okay, I have to kill off Bond right now. Because he's not disabled no more. Oh my god. And my Liz is locked. My Liz is locked, too. I gotta use as many cards as possible to get rid of this god dang um, Bond right now. Oh, now you want to crit. Come on, Sario. Let's go, GG. <laughs> That's a, he has. A, he had a really good team. He had a really good team. I don't know why he let me ult with Margaret though. He made me. He ended up stalling too much. He let me ult with Margaret. Like, that's two turns of being disabled. That's really bad for his team. GG. What did he have in the back? He had a really good team. Athena. Mm, makes sense. Like, the more and more I'm playing PP, I'm starting to realize <laughs> with with the, the addition of LR King, it's really bad. It's really hard to use this team. Again, this used to be my most fun team in Chaos PP, but because LR King kind of counters me, especially Margaret, because that disabled. It's really hard unless I can like hit King or something and what is this team ouch I hurt dang I hurt dang he knows that he know that that car hurts right um all right let me go for this then just to heal up a little bit more I'm assuming his Liz must be 6-6 six, six. Which does make sense because I can see double damage reduction. Has Liz even returned on a banner? I think she has. I just got back bad luck with her. I think her, I think mine is still like, I think four four out of six. I think I get like one damage reduction stack. This guy is really cooking me right now. He's really cooking me with this Liz though. Like, I literally can't do nothing because of that Liz. And she has ultimate. Wow. I'm assuming she has real timing link as well, too. Oh, no. Mael? I don't think Mael is going to save me, though. Because he has so many damage reduction right now. Dang. Yeah, it's GG. Let's see his damage though. Oh wait, she killed. <laughs> no way, she killed. <laughs> oh my god, I was literally like, "Yo, I lost, man. I'll, I'll, I'll accept my L." Or oh, we like, "Yo, I'll accept my L, man." GG. Nah, we cooked him. Holy snap. Yeah, he lost. Yeah, I can see why that, that Liz get no play in PP, bro. She sucks. Don't he lose again? Like, if I just AoE spam? Or should I just play it? Or should I play more safe? I think I should play more safe. And just do this. I think if I could have just AoE'd with Margaret, just to force crits, I could have just finished that guy off. See, like that. GG. 277k and he got cooked like that crazy bad rng for that man freaking liz just cooked that man i want y'all to look at his cc again 277k featuring liz margaret elat and roxy man big old whale that's a big whale all right we got karis arthur zanary and then we got terry um i don't know what we gonna do with this information but we're gonna try to do something i guess i can try to get rid of 
an area real quick. Because again, my team is a slow build type of team. Oh, I should have probably just. I probably should have saved my Sario stance though. Because nobody else is going to do damage first turn. Oh, we got. We got cards though. Okay. My man said, yo, let me move my cards a billion times. Um. All right, let me go for this then. He's doing too much moving car movement for my liking. And you're not dead. Wow. Wow. I'm pretty sure I lose this because I have no ultimates. If he gets a Rosario though, if he gets a Rosario, we can win. Okay. Gonna lower his crit damage real quick. Uh, tank. He not he did not she did not tank that hopefully he doesn't go for mark right here freaking liz died too wow all right so it's my only way i just love how his freaking arthur has in budge in terms of hp <gasps> he got nuked. That's GG then. He lost. Oh my god. I'm sitting here like, bro, his HP did not budge. Did he have like Jillian in the back or something? What the? He did actually. Wow. I'm like, why is the HP not budging? All right, we got a Usak and a Salt Mole Meliodas. Um, this is going to be pretty interesting. And by interesting, I mean we about to cook him. All right, we're gonna go for this and then cleanse afterwards because I'm toxic. I probably should have saved it just because it was one one attack. Unless I get another Margaret cleanse, it might be... Oh, okay, I did. This is going to definitely be a little bit annoying to face in PvP, especially if you don't get any cards. Cause with me, it seems like every card I get is usually featuring Sario. Maybe because the position I got Sario in, which is probably what's happening. He's low key proccing my passive too while he's doing all this. Okay. And. Probably go for this. Just to finish off his two care two demons. Get them out the way. Alright. Oh, he forfeits. GG. 